Good morning Gemini, or good day Gemini, this is Char from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back my Cyber Angels and thank you very much for your loyalty and loyal following and thank you for your likes and shares. Okay, this is your reading Gemini for the 27th till the 2nd of August. We are already in Leo um, and if you are a cross watcher, happy birthday. And also we are going into the month of August. Time flies. Wow, if you think of it in this way, only five more months to go and it is Christmas to the day, Christmas Eve. It's the 24th of July today, so in five months time it will be Christmas Eve. Crazy how time flies. Okay, and if you're new, welcome to this channel and I hope you will enjoy it. Remember this is a general reading and if it doesn't resonate with you, just take from it what you can. If it doesn't resonate with you, have a look at your moon sign and your rising sign. Okay, Please subscribe and click on the bell and on all then you should be notified by YouTube. But the system is still having hiccups, baby hiccups as they call it, because we've gone over into a new system in March and please make sure that you are still uh, a member of your favorite channels as um, YouTube um, has deleted uh, 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 memberships and make sure that you uh, are subscribed to your favorite channels my darling and it's uh, I have for example one friend she's become a friend she was a viewer and I can't find her and she uh, she says she is a member but I can't find her um, until um, she'll come back into the live sessions again and then I can make her moderator again it was one of my moderators okay and uh, you can join me in the live sessions on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Um, I give away free cards but I also answer questions that are supported by a super chat or a super sticker. And I do set out notifications because of the mistakes from YouTube on Facebook and Instagram. You can find me there as well. Okay, so let's begin. This is the Quirin card, or the overall energy. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. And this card in the corner is a Lenormand card. And that will clarify the three cards around it and vice versa. So you're getting extra messages here. And then I've got the um, uh, reading, the angel reading cards. These are beautiful cards. They're really big as an extra and I've got Archangel Metatron cards and that's one of my favorites I love Archangel Metatron because he's the angel of the white light the divine light that clears our chakras if you know me you know that I'm also a Reiki master um, and that I work with the angelic chakras and the normal Reiki chakras okay chakra let's get started Jimmy Jim Jims and I'm not doing the uh, the one that has got the most readings as I've been pre-recording the videos due to personal circumstances but your first card is the Hierophant and the Hierophant is number five on the big arcana so you might not be in balance um, on this week this is the overall energy or you might this could be also you and I'm taking it as both okay so you might feel out of whack but um, this the high event also represents that you might be seeking advice uh, from a professional or from a mature man or uh, um, a father figure somebody that you've got respect for if you are in a judicial situation then of course you would seek advice from a lawyer or an advocate if you have uh, health issues you would be seeking advice from your doctor uh, or if you are uh, having uh, relationship issues then you might be seeking advice from a marriage guidance counselor but um, 
I think you might be getting married or thinking of getting married, so you might be seeking spiritual advice from a priest, like making an appointment for the church wedding, or you might be making seeking advice from a registry office, and so to get an appointment for your wedding at the registry office. See how um, it, things come together. Above you, you have the Justice card. Now, the, the Hierophant also represents Aries, okay? And the Judgment card represents Libra. Like I said, you might be out of balance. Justice is usually like the scales, like the two arms of the trees are the scales. Okay, so you want to get back into balance. You might be uh, seeking advice because you uh, want to get a different perspective. Look at that little owl looking down. You want to get to the truth. You want clarity. You want justice, perhaps. If you are in a judicial situation, this could be also um, the court or the lawyer or the advocate that I was talking about that you are seeking advice from. There is a new beginning though, because the angels have uh, are here. There is number eleven. That's the arc, uh, arc, archway or the doorway that the angels are giving you. So there is a new beginning, but you have to step through it, and you will step through it so long you've got the right um, advice that will bring you back into balance. Wow. So be strong. Get seek that information. That is what the air signs do as well. They cut straight through to the core. Okay, um, cut away the BS, and they want honesty, clarity, so that they can uh, communicate and have justice, and something is would be clear to them and bring them back into balance. Wow. Once you've got that, you will be making plans for the future or forming partnerships so this could be seeking information on how to draw up legal contracts uh, because uh, of partnerships you've got the two of ones again you've got the two back into balance you're making plans for the future Ooh, and you've got the crystal ball there so with this advice you will um, be able to make the right plans, the just plans, and the right way for the future to bring you security. Wow. Then we have the King of Pentacles, and before I saw this, I thought, right, to make, to, if you are forming a, a partnership in a business, then something that will bring in money steadily but surely, or giving the right um, investment right now look at this for long term making plans so your plans are going to come to fruition because whatever you do you've got the meters touch so everything will turn out right it will turn out positively it will turn everything you touch will turn to gold so it will turn to positivity money long term you've got no sorry it's not the king of it's the knight anyway uh, that is what I'm hearing so you must I must have got this message because this will be for long term and steady income look at this you'll get news okay this could be from an Aries could be from uh, a Libra or a lawyer or somebody in um, institutions or municipalities you're doing the right way you're making plans you've like the king of pentacles he also looks what is the right way to invest okay so that there will be bringing returns at the night of pentacles is steady but slow slow but steady he's got the four feet on the ground he will see return after return if this is with regard to um, um, a Libra, an Aries, or a Virgo, a Sagittarius, or a uh, Capricorn, then you will be certain that this is this partnership has durability and for long term. Okay, so long you get 
things clear and you are forming the right partnership whether it's uh, business or in love and um, perhaps you might be going to the registry office and you want to get married in church this is the quick message that I'm getting okay you perhaps um, I'm also getting a weird question here or an answer if somebody's choosing to bring the registry to the church I don't know if that can can be done um, but in some cases perhaps you might be getting the two in one building Wow so that you don't have to go to the registry first and then to the church or vice versa I think it's going to come together yes I think that is one or two of you might be planning that as well there will be celebrations though as you have the three of cups well if you are forming partnerships and it's going to happen uh, whether it's marriage or work business then you will be celebrating with friends and family whoa and what am I seeing here Wow, well, a wish is coming true a goal is coming true you have the star and it's number 16 and 16 um, me, it will be a seven so luck is on your side and you've got the six of hearts the six of hearts means that somebody might be coming back from the past and if I was doing an extended reading then this would be the past the present and the future energy the possibility of what the energy could be because energy changes from one second to the next so there could be somebody coming back from the past as this is the six of cups and might be giving you a present perhaps you've been waiting for somebody to return perhaps somebody has been away and is now returning it could be somebody that works in the marines or in the air force and they've been away for uh, a year six months that is the past as well and they are bringing back a gift for you perhaps a proposal to marriage because I've also got the couple as I see that's why I went wow and families will come together Whoa. and that will be a big party two reasons for a big party so the balance will be back because your wish or dream is coming true and you will be seeking advice perhaps you might be getting this news from the institution that your beloved works for okay they are coming home wow this is mind-blowing it's getting a life of its own this reading you're seeing so much in it okay but your wish is coming true which is good and you've got the ace of hearts here love passion nurturing new beginnings this could be in business this could be in literally love or a new passion if you aren't hooked up okay and we've also got the man in the Lenamon so a man might be returning a man is also steadfastness security stands with both feet on the ground strength you are in your strength at the moment if this is not a man that you're meeting perhaps your masculine side might be popping up and you might be more business like absolutely fantastic now you've got number 28 there and number 28 uh, is a 10 so something is coming to an end and again a new beginning and he's looking towards his new beginning because he's expecting news and this will be for with durability and for long term this man is also this could be like I said the man a mature man seeking advice so if you're a man you could be seeking advice from an Aries or a man or um, you could be um, getting news or asking advice um, 
about business if you are a lady and you your masculine side your your career side your business side you might seek advice from a man but you are more business orientated I think this reading is about more about business and partnerships um, it could be marriage but have a look at your romance reading again and see uh, whether you can get information from the romance uh, reading that relates to this reading just a tip okay darlings I think it is about seeking business and advice okay that you might be celebrating with an other man this could be also a, not only a partner in business but also it could be um, a, a, a love partner I do believe in uh, uh, same-sex uh, marriages or relationships but so and um, because it doesn't matter who you love okay whether you're heterosexual or gay it doesn't matter you do have the feminine and masculine in both relationships and I think it's important um, if you are somebody that loves somebody from the same sex the most important thing in love is trust, respect, um, loyalty, and honesty. I don't know, this had to come out. So, you know, you know whether this reading resonates to you or not. Okay. But you are in your strength. The man also means strength to me. Now, we've got the lady in the next corner, so that's why I'm saying there could be a coupling up. Uh, perhaps a lady might be coming back, okay? Uh, perhaps a man might be coming back if you're a lady, but there will be a coupling up. We've got the Ace of Spades. Now, if you follow me, then you know that the Ace of Spades is the Ace of Swords there will be clarity there will be victory especially with these two really institutional cards um, uh, advice uh, these two people are advices justice you will have victory big time you might even start a new study if you are uh, uh, doing a, if you are forming a business partnership uh, in uh, in in like say you're going to open up a shop or a, a computer website shop um, you might not know how to do things uh, cut and paste and make advertisements so you might start a new study on how to uh, do uh, Photoshop or cut and paste and make announcements something like that because this is also the card not only for wisdom to gather the knowledge and to seek the knowledge but also on communication you might learn how to communicate much better to put your dots on the eyes and cross your T's on your website Wow um, sometimes you know it and you'll be passing the knowledge on to your partner this is all about communication justice clarity uh, and wisdom so and this could be a Gemini a Libra um, and an Aquarian okay okay that you could be meeting Gemini so you might be meeting your own uh, element or you could be meeting a Cancer a Scorpio or a Pisces and you might partner up with them it can be a woman it can be a man okay uh, perhaps the Pisces to in my feeling the Pisces will be more business like um, uh, perhaps more intuitive or more sensitive so be careful with your sh with your how you talk watch out your intonation because they are sensitive okay they are loving nurturing and caring just like you but you know how to keep your emotions under control okay 
um, because you can, we have we are the element of the sword, so we we can be swift and cuts where necessary. But don't also not only with the tongue, but in our actions. So don't make hasty decisions. Communicate with your partner. Uh, get it clear. Get the precise things that how you want this to work, the partnership, the the the, the firm, etc., etc., because you'll have to repent in leisure, and you don't want to do that. It will take, it will throw you back two steps or three. So be careful. Make the right plans. Get the right advice on how to do things. Uh, perhaps this could be a teacher because you're going to update your knowledge. Okay you're always eager to learn uh, also uh, take more time I get to hear take more time be nurturing or uh, and nurture your study nurture your plans open your heart follow your heart be a little bit gentler and slower like the water sign okay let your masculine and female side come out come into balance boom beautiful okay now we're going on to the last card new beginnings love and it could be also in study or work Ooh, exciting exciting now you've also got the scythe okay the scythe is you're cutting away with the BS but be make sure that everything is clear to you before you can put your plans into fruition you want that return constant return okay now let's have a look this is the page of diamonds so you will this you've got the page and the night okay so you will get more news more messages like I said you this is the pentacles and this is pentacles because this is diamonds so you might be meeting or de have dealings with a Virgo Capricorn or a Taurus okay you will receive news endings new beginnings number 10 you're cutting away with the past and you're harvesting because you're harvesting and cutting away with the past this is the one you're going on to two you've made the plans and I think they are going to come to fruition you're putting it into action with the right advice and you're going to get justice okay you might be receiving news that justice is done you might be even receiving money this could be a loan, this could be a mortgage, this could be a, a, a damage claim uh, because we've got the two advocates here or lawyers um, so justice, this could be the courts, you might have been f going to court and you're getting justice so there might be money coming your way now with this card I, it says the angel of divine time again a five 32 is 5 and 5 you've got two fives again two numbers the same um, so there we go again 11 29 you've got 11 11 you've got number 28 which is a 10 10 uh, 10 so you've got two tens two 11s and two fives okay it's all uh, about new beginnings and the angels are here with you it is the divine time angel okay it's divine timing the divine has seen that what what your wishes are you what your plans are and now it is time for the next step justice will be done sorry We've also got 22 again an angel number the angels are showing that they are here big time okay you've got Archangel Sandalphon with you now that is also the angel of the uh, muse of music he is also the angel not only of music but um, if I look at this this is the angel 
the yellow chakra um, that is Archangel Jovial but he is also the angel of soothing okay it goes into the secretal from yellow the solar plex jovial to the secretal and the secretal area um, that is also the area of rebirth and that is also Archangel Gabriel um, from the secretal chakra so he will be there with Archangel um, Gabriel working together bringing in the music into your life and you will be earthed and that is uh, the red chakra the root chakra um, so you will be standing in your power Archangel Sandalfon is also the angel of power the angel of tears this could be tears of joy or tears of sadness but yeah, I think it will be the tears of joy because we've got celebration here and Archangel De, uh, Sandalfon is also an angel that delivers uh, news um, to uh, answers to your prayers and that is the wish card beautiful absolutely a beautiful reading jimmies so you will get justice if you are in a judicial situation you will be back in balance your plans are coming to fruition wow you are receiving news Archangel Sandalfon is definitely with you and Archangel um, uh, I've got uh, also a feeling Archangel Metatron okay remember time is man-made but the time is right now as you have the card angel of divine timing something is coming to an end the angels are definitely here with 11 11 and uh, 22 11 and 11 is also 22 look how much they are speaking to you Jimmy okay I hope you have enjoyed this reading please uh, like and share and I hope to see you in the live session I, um, and you know I'll also put out a notification in the community tab uh, on YouTube if you are not a member of Facebook or Instagram so keep an eye out on the day Monday Wednesday and Friday um, for the notification take care have a beautiful weekend and stay safe and be blessed thank you for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it and remember have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell on all and I'll see you in the life Monday Wednesday or Friday ciao ciao